Viewers and subscribers, you're welcome back again. This is the BBI channel one where we tell you undiluted truth. And I'm bringing you this gospel truth to Africans who are religiously enslaved. How will I explain to these my people that the battle they are fighting spiritually is not really their problem? They are carrying machete and stick to pursue unseen spirit. As the Bible told us that the battle we are fighting is not flesh and blood but principalities and powers and rulers in the high places that they cannot see but I must tell you that the principalities the Bible is telling you Africans are the principalities and powers in your government houses how will I explain to these people that by carrying machete and stick in touch Praying fire down will not change the economy. Will not better their lives. Will not provide security for them. Will not provide food on their table. Will not create job for their children. Even the Oibos and Chinese who don't even believe in God teach their children how to be innovative, how to be creative, how to be economically viable to add value to the society. But in Africa, they'll teach your children how to do fire, 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 fire. Fire in what? I am not here to mock any religion, especially the Christians, because I am a Christian, but I am not a church goer. Because this church madness and blue, ha <laughs> ha, had drowned Christians. Many of them have perished because of lack of knowledge. And that knowledge is what we're bringing to you. I'm telling you this truth. I just hope you help me spread it. So that Nigerians especially, we know that if they like, let them pray from now to the next century. With the crop of people in power today as we have, it will only get worse. And you make God a liar, and the wicked one who doesn't answer prayers because they are giving you everything. God is so disappointed in Africa and their religious madness. Because today, as I speak, millions of Africans, especially in Nigeria, go to every nook and cranny. It is church, church, church. I see plenty of church from my area. You know what we did down, down there in our church? This one, our church. This one, our church. This one, our church. Oh. I'm going to see another church here again. The other one where you can see in our church, living faith. For one area, we have about six churches. Okay. Oh, Nigeria, on our way down, no. On Friday, it is most, most, most. They pray from January to December, yet their lives remain worse. Get worse every day. So, who is then the problem? We are the problem. We must change our attitude. And that is the gospel of truth. I am preaching. This kind of video doesn't go viral. But I just hope you that is watching, if you believe in this truth, just click on the share button and spread this truth to other people. I'm Asuchiro Peters. I'm signing out for now.